Chrissy, we've not spoken to you. How was your summer? Very good, yeah. Nice little rest. Not quite long enough for my liking, but um, had some good time, family and friends, um, ready to get back at it. Your 16th season in professional football. Uh, does the pre-seasons get any easier? No, uh, they certainly do not. Um, you just learn to be able to deal with them that little bit better, I think, um, work yourself through the pain um, and understand load management, as they call it nowadays, uh, when you need to scale back a little bit at my age. So, um, no, nah, it's all part and parcel of it. Um, I think it's a good time for, for bonding amongst the lads, bringing the new guys in um, and us going through the, the blood, sweat and tears, so to speak, together. I think it can, can forge good relationships for us moving into the season. You mentioned there forging good relationships and new lads in the squad. Have you taken anyone under your wing, shown them around, shown them around the city yet? or? Not yet, not yet. Uh, they're, st they're still in hotels, unfortunately, trying to sort themselves out places. But um, I know um, Cal from previously and got some, some mutual friends as well. So um, we've been speaking a, a fair bit, but um, I'm not sure any of them want to come under my wing, to be honest. We're on day five now, pre-season. How's it been so far this week? Uh, how are you getting on? I feel good, yeah. Body feels in good shape. Um, feel, feel fresh mentally. Um, it's been tough uh, at times, but it's exactly what we've expected. Um, there's a few moans and groans, uh, as you as you would uh, as you would expect from a few of the guys. But no, the, the body's holding up really well, um, and we're, we're looking forward to ramping up over the next few days. So the fixture lists are out. We've got Hull away at the end of end of July. It's a bit of an earlier start. Are you like really excited for that first game or are you looking forward to pre-season getting ready first? I think it's just about getting ourselves in shape for that. Obviously, we know it's slightly earlier um, this season. That's why we're in a little bit earlier. We've still got the same amount of time, I think six weeks lead up to that first game. Um, it's exciting when the fixtures come out. You get to, get to see who you're, you're playing against and, and, and when, obviously, and see the run-ins and, and whatnot. Um, but that's for, for other people to kind of decide whether they think it's uh, tough or or easy, to be honest with you. We go into every single game, um, obviously, looking to win it. And, and we've got, um, I think, a lot of hope after the way that we finished last season, um, moving into the beginning of this season. So hopefully we can take that form into it. You mentioned that lot of hope in the end of last season, a 5-0 win to finish at Ashton Gate. Sunderland up first at Ashton Gate. Are you excited for that day? For sure, yeah. It's always nice to play in front of the fans. And obviously, with how things are going to go over pre-season, obviously, I don't think we're going to get to, to play in front of them, um, obviously, at Ashton Gate. So that'll be um, extra special, I think, for, for the fan base. And hopefully, we can um, make it a good start. Thank you, Chris. Cheers.